Alright, so what is going on you guys and welcome back to another video on the channel and as you guys can tell, uh, today we've got a challenge based around the Recon Expert skin. As you guys know, the Recon Expert, which was the rarest skin in the game, has returned to the item shop and today we've got a video based around this where I'm going to be doing it so I can only use Season 1 loot to try and get a win. So, as you guys know, the Recon Expert came out in Season 1. It didn't come out in the item shop for like 900 days or something, but obviously it came back yesterday uh, in the item shop for like 1,200 V-Bucks with a new style. I'm going to be using it in today's video, trying to get a win but instead of just playing a normal game as I mentioned we're going to spice it up a little bit and use season 1 loot only just to make it a bit more difficult and to make the video a bit more interesting so yeah if you guys do go on to enjoy the video don't forget to drop a like on it and of course subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and your post notifications turned on let's try and go for 30 likes on today's video that's the goal if we can hit that that would be insane um, but yeah, in terms of like the actual challenge and how it's going to work I'll talk about that more in the actual gameplay but it is literally as simple as I can only use season 1 loot to win so no drum gun no harpoon gun no heavy sniper no mini gun no crash pads, nothing like that, it's only simple loot from season 1, so assault rifle, tack, pump, all that type of stuff. Um, in terms of the actual item shop today, obviously the recon expert is still out, and we've got the dark bomber and other stuff like that, so if you guys are thinking of picking up anything from today's item shop, you can use my credit code CoreyJT123 to support me, that would be much appreciated. In terms of the actual preset that I've got as well, I've actually made one around the recon expert, so I've got the skin itself, as you can see on screen right now, I've got a nice rare uh, season 1 pickaxe as well to go with it. Obviously that did return to the item shop, so it's not rare, but it is from season one. I've got a winner's umbrella from season 2 chapter 1 so I was actually quite a rare glider there. In terms of my emotes as well I've got all season 1 and season 2 emotes so the floss, the worm, ride the pony, electro shuffle, all that type of stuff. I've got a camo there to match the actual colours or the recon expert skin, the OG lobby music you know I've got it all ready so yeah we're looking prepared for this challenge hope you guys go on to enjoy the video and yeah let's get straight into the gameplay. Alright, so as you guys can see, I'm going to be landing at Logjam Woods. Uh, it's actually a really good location to land in solos. It's got really good loot, uh, a lot of mats as well, and it's right next to Slurpee Swamp, so, you know, you get some easy shield from that as well, and maybe rotation, you know, get some kills. Um, it's a really good place to land. Uh, first up, we've got a green pistol, so, I mean, that was from Season 1. We've got some nades as well, so, we good so far. A uh, grey pump up there as well. I'm going to grab that. Alright, chest up here. Hopefully, I can get, like, a green AR or a blue AR. that will be perfect. Oh, gold org. Wait, can I use that? Yo, I don't know if I can. I mean, technically the burst was in the game, in Season 1, but obviously this isn't like, this is technically a different weapon, because it's like the org, it's like a gold version, so... I'm gonna play it safe. I mean, I, I could pick it up though. I know, this is a tough one. This is the thing about this challenge, you don't really know like what you can and can't use, because... Like, as I mentioned, the burst is like a weapon that was in the game, in Season 1, but the gold burst is technically like a different weapon, it's like the org. Even though it is like a different rarity of the actual burst. I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to drop it. It's a tough one. I don't know. I could easily just keep this, but to make the challenge even more difficult, I think. Yeah, I think I'm gonna drop it. All right. There's a green AR there as well. There we go. I'll take that. I know I could have easily just used that burst in the video and gone for a win, but it's a challenge for a reason. You know, I want to make it difficult for myself and limit the weapons I can use. Because as I mentioned, like the org is technically like a different weapon compared to like the grey burst. So. You know, I could count it, but I think I'm just gonna, you know, use the green air uh, just to make it a bit more difficult. Um, it doesn't look like anyone else landed here in Logjam Woods. As you guys can see, there's a lot of wooden pallets here, um, so you can easily get 99 wood by landing here. Somebody in a chopper over there. Okay, yeah, they're really far away. I don't know where they're going. I don't know where they got the chopper from, but definitely I yeah, won't be able to get that kill. All right, I'll stock up on wood. Um, in terms of my loot, I mean, you know, it's not too bad. Obviously, it's all season one. Uh, we've got an assault rifle, a pump, a pistol, grenades, and bandages. That's looking pretty decent. Um, but yeah, in terms of the actual loot that I can use for this challenge, so um, I did mention it briefly in the beginning of this video, but it is literally just season one loot. So, um, you know, assault rifle, pump, tack, pistol, grenades, uh, you know, bandages, med kits, you know, shield, all that type of stuff. I can't even use fish, you know, I can't use any of that. Um, it's just a basic, simple loot that's been in the game since the beginning. Um, obviously, launch pads I can use. They did get added to the game, I think, in an update uh, towards, like, the end of Season 1, so I can't launch pads. Um, but, yeah, like, anything else, you know, other than that, um, I won't be able to use, so... Yeah, it's definitely going to be quite difficult. Uh, hopefully, though, we can get the win because I know a lot of people do want me to actually do like more challenge videos. So, um, yeah, I know a lot of people do enjoy these as well, just like more chill, laid-back videos where I'm just playing a game, commentating, um, and just going for a win, you know. So, yeah, if you have any more like challenge ideas that you want me to give a go, let me know down in the comment section down below because I want to try and like do more of these types of videos. So, if you have a good challenge idea, I might try it for a video soon. So, yeah, leave a comment. Okay, I did your shots from this direction. Yeah, somebody on that roof over there. Could try and push that. Wait, somebody right here as well. 
Okay, that guy was just a bit uh, distracted there with the fishing. Yo, he had minis as well. I don't know why he didn't drink them. He literally had, like, no shield. I don't know why he didn't drink those minis. There's slurp barrels here as well. I don't know what that guy was doing, but I'm not going to complain. Easy kill. I'm going to take those nades over the pistol. I think that's a smart idea. In terms of my loadout, it was all looking pretty decent. Green AR, green tack. I've got some grenades, got some minis. Gonna chuck these on. Get our shield up. Got some med as well. Looking good. What's this guy doing? What was he shooting at? Is there somebody over there? Dude, I'm so confused. I think that was an actual AI bot. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna complain though. You know, it's an easy free kill. I'll take it, but I don't know how there's bots in my lobby. Alright, is loot. Got some ammo, some mats, some more minis. I had a green pump. Uh, I'm not gonna take that though. I'm gonna stick with the attack. Especially since I don't have an SMG. Obviously, I've got some nades instead. I think I'm a lot more comfortable with attack. Um, but yeah, we're in Slurpee right now. I'm going to get my shield up. Just chill in the swamp for a bit and uh, yeah, get the 100 shield. Well, there's people fighting right here. Can I can get both these kills. Come on. Let's go. There's one. Dude, I'm missing all my shots right now. Need a reload as well. Aura skin. I think they may be a sweat. Dude, I don't have an SMG. Alright, I need to keep this high ground. Gonna heal up. Get these minis on. Yeah, they're just chilling down there. I, like, I would like to have an SMG right now. That would be perfect, but... Unfortunately, I just got nades instead, which... Nades aren't really too useful in this situation. It's not really gonna work. I'm just gonna have to use my uh, AR to, like, spray. Alright, thankfully we got all these minis, because... We're, uh, we're taking quite a bit of damage right now. Yeah, they're just still boxed up. They're on metal, so... I don't know if they're low on mats. Dude, what am I doing? Oh my god. I had my mi uh, minis out instead of my tack. That was so bad. Trying to build up. Ryan just keep blocking him off. Trying to get some shots on him. I think that's probably my tactic, this fight. I think they're a decent player. 42, 59, 36. Yeah, they're weak. I need to push this. Let's go. Alright, GG. Got minis, we've got a big shield. I'll take that. Uh, have they got med as well? Yeah, they do, alright. I'll carry that. Green tack. Not green tack, uh, legendary tack. What am I on about? Uh, I'm going to keep the green tack though because technically the tactical shotgun was obviously a gun in season 1. But the gold and purple version of the tack is technically like a different version of that gun. Um, and it's a lot better. So I'm going to stick with the original um, green tack from season 1. And obviously, well, the legendary tack wasn't a thing in uh, season 1 as well. It was just a purple one. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, I can't pick up that. I would like to take the gold one, but obviously, um, that would be cheating. It is season 1 loot only. Um, but yeah, in terms of like season 1 loot only, though, I've got a pretty decent loadout so far. So I'm not going to complain. Four kills to one aim. Not too bad. Hopefully, we can get this win. Okay, I did see a fish skin over the hill. Um, yeah, he's right there, grabbing that slurp truck. Okay, him twice. Alright, spam these nades. Come on, hopefully at least one of those hit. Let's go. Alright, yeah, he's pretty much one shot right now. Can't let him heal. He's building up. Okay, yeah, this guy knows what he's doing. You can tell this guy's a good player. Give me that wall. This guy's literally one shot. I have no SMG. I can't spray him. Dude, you're so weak. Literally just one shot I need on him. Alright, I'm gonna quickly drink this big shield. Just play it safe, you know. I don't wanna get uh, too complacent with this fight. And end up getting like one pumped or something. I don't know which box he's in. Is he in this one? Yeah, he's in here. Dude, I'm missing all my shots. I'm choking right now. Oh my god. Ho! Oh, let's go. Jeez, that was a close one. Alright. Blue tack. I'll take that. Um, as, I, as I mentioned, that SMG wasn't in the game in Season 1. It was a different SMG, so... Unfortunately, I can't take that. Head back to the swamp, though. 
and yeah, get some more shield because I'm quite weak right now. Okay, I think there's somebody above me, just like chilling up top in like a base. Some spare loot here as well. Yeah, I could just try and build up and like try and get a skill. I don't have too many mats, but it might be enough for this fight. I'm just gonna chill down here though for a bit. I don't wanna play too aggressive because, as I mentioned, my loot isn't the best right now. I've just got an AR, an attack, and a few grenades as well. No SMG, no spare heals as well. No sniper, no RPG, nothing like that. I'm gonna build up. He's using crash pads? Yeah, where even is he? Oh, he's right there. Probably gonna use another crash pad, right? If he has any. I'm not sure. I could just drop down right now and push this guy, but my loot isn't the best, as I mentioned, so I'm just gonna play a bit more um you know, like a passive, I guess you could say. I don't wanna play too aggressive this game. I wanna try and get the win. That's the main goal. There's a launch pad right below as well, so we might have to use that to get the zone. It's editing. Go on peak. Okay, got a few shots. Let's go. Wait, what? How did he get down there? He's just spamming crash pads, dude. What is this guy doing? Go, go zone as well. Alright, I'll use your crash pad. I'll take it. Is he up top? I think he is, right? Let me check. Yeah, he's up there. Please. Let's go. Alright. Um, purple RPG, give me that. Dude, he has a gold pump. Wow. I wish I could take that, but... Um, yeah, gold pump and purple pump wasn't a thing back in Season 1. I'm pretty sure I just went after blue rarity. So, unfortunately, we can't take that. I'm going to have to stick with a blue tack, which is still decent, I guess, but... Obviously, a gold pump would be like 10 times better. Alright, I'm going to chill here. Heal up. Chuck these minis on. Unfortunately, no white heals, like no meds or anything, but we should be good. There's people fighting over here. If I can steal these kills. One shot. Literally one shot. If I can try and get this kill. I don't get sniped. He's probably going to use that launch pad, I'm guessing. Yeah, we got to rotate now. I'm going to have to move as well. But I'm going to try and apply some pressure, get this kill. I do have nades, I could try and maybe use them. Okay, <laughs> that did not work. I'm going to try and use this RPG as well. If I can do this. Come on, let's go. Whew. Dude, everyone has like purple and gold pumps. Dude, he has Midas' drum gun as well. I wish I could pick that up. I'll have to take the nades though instead, even though I don't need them. I've got an RPG. Nades are kind of useless. I mean, well, they could come in useful, I guess. But I'm probably not going to end up using them. I would much rather the uh, Mythic Drum Gun, for sure. Last the thing about this challenge, it's not easy. Against Spirit of Rockets as well. This is actually my first attempt at this challenge, by the way. I just want to quickly mention that. Got seven kills to our name. We're in a decent position here. Um, we have a decent amount of materials, nothing too special, but hopefully enough to get us to win, hopefully. Yeah, they're fighting each other. Somebody in the base over there as well. Circle is moving. What's this guy building? What's he doing? Alright, spray those rockets. Dark bomber skin. If I can do this and then shoot the wall. Ah, oh, damn. I thought that was going to work. Need to be careful of the guy over there as well. That's gonna hit. Dude, why didn't he build a floor? I right, hit him though, he's weak. If that gets a kill. Oh my god. No. I have no heals as well. Alright, we were in a really good position then, and now all of a sudden, we're in a really bad situation. Low health, no heals. I wanna try and get a kill on this guy. So hopefully he'll have some heals for us. 
got them weak, but they probably healed up. I'm getting sprayed by that guy's self as well. Come on. Alright. My plan is shoot the rocket and then shoot at the wolf. Come on. What? Ah, dude. I did not even realize. Why didn't I place a wall? I don't know what I was doing there. Ah, GG's. The dream skin. They were weak as well. They were only like 50 health. That was a close game. That was a good end game. Um, it's a difficult challenge there, but I mean, GG. That's probably going to end it there, though. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, as I mentioned, if you have any more challenge ideas that you want me to try, let me know in the comment section down below, and I'll probably try them soon. But as you can see, we've got 7 kills. It wasn't too bad for the Season 1 loot only challenge with a recon expert. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.